Hello and welcome to my cricket live. And I have my guest with me. His name is Simon, and he is from Uganda. He is the rising star of Uganda cricket. He has scored the most runs for Uganda so far, one thousand plus runs. Congrats on that! And he has recently scored a hundred. That's the first time any Uganda players have hit the T20 hundred. Welcome to my show. Thank you, thank you, and uh, I'm really happy to be on this show. And yeah, I'm happy to talk about some issues. Yes. Uh, first thing I want to know about is the Uganda cricket. How is the cricket going in there, and how is the culture, and how people are crazy about it? Please, can you please tell me? Because I'm from Bangladesh, and I want to know more about them. Uh, cricket in Uganda is good. Uh, a lot of youngsters, a lot of talent in Uganda is. Uh, uh, we play a lot of cricket, both locally. Now we have started uh, the journey of playing more international games, both uh, ODI and T20, which is a, a very good thing for Uganda cricket. And you know, as Uganda cricket is a a rising. Uh, a de de developing country in cricket, but uh, yeah, uh, basing on the talent that is in Uganda, and uh, yeah, there is a lot that is coming in, and I, I believe we'll reach to the high level. Yes, thanks. Yes, it is the rising country because in Africa we have South Africa, Zimbabwe, Namibia, and at fourth I will give Uganda, right? Yeah. And my next question will be: uh, You have started playing for international team that's from 2021, and within one or two years, you have become the most popular and most successful batsman. So tell me about the journey as a young player and now playing into the highest level. Um, I I made my debut in. Uh... Uh, to 2021 uh, that is a, a t20 debut and uh, yeah it has it has not been easy because uh, it took me a long time to play the t20 version but yeah uh, maybe last year was the my breakthrough year because uh, on my debut I scored a 50 on my debut my, that was my first match and yeah it was it was my go much and i believe yeah from from there up to now i've i've still continued to to score more runs and yeah i'm very happy to be the first uh player in uganda to score 100 and to to reach that a thousand mark runs and i believe yeah more is coming yes thank you and my second question will be you have a good form right now you are the most uh, highly rated player in Uganda and do you want to continue this way and play have a better year in 2023 yeah um, I'm actually aiming for high I really want to, to to play more I really want to break more records I really want to set more records uh, in 2023 and 2024 uh, yeah I want to be you know that uh, a legendary player that everyone re looks up to uh, in the Uganda cricket, and yeah, I believe I'll achieve it because I'm I'm doing my best and I'm doing the best for the country also. Yes. Well, I'm sure you will do a great job, and future in future you will become the captain of Uganda team. We never know, <laughs> yes? I hope so, I hope so, I don't know. Yes. I, I hope so. Yes. So, uh, in Uganda 2023, do you have any future plans, right? Like, you have any series or something coming up? Tell me about that. Yeah, we have uh, many tournaments next year. There is a tournament in March uh, in Dubai. There is a tournament in, uh, we have a series in Namibia in April. And uh, yeah, mm -hmm. uh, and we have qualifiers, World Cup qualifiers in uh, in uh, yes, yes. in uh, October in Namibia, and yeah, mm -hmm. we have a lot of engagements next year. So uh, next year is going to be a very big year for us, 
and yeah, depending on the form I have, I just can't believe that I continue having it till next year so that yeah, I also end the year in a high. Yeah, I wish you a lots of runs and lots of 50, lots of 100, lots of sixes to you, my friend. And my, my yes, my next question. Uh, I was looking at your stats and I was just comparing and I just want to let you know that do you know that you have already have, uh, written it up all there. You have already 10 T20 50s and 100 and you we have just played 40 matches that means every fourth match you are getting a 50 which is a very great thing and what is your mindset while batting um i just do the simple things right sometimes when i go into the game i, I really want to perform and uh yeah sometimes uh, my mindset is uh make sure that i stay on the wicket more because staying on the wicket more means I, I, I I'm getting that the, the runs. So yeah, I, mostly that is uh, what comes into mind every time I go to bat. I, I really want to play a lot of balls, uh, and uh, play a lot of balls means uh, I'll still need to score a lot of runs. So that's that's what comes into my mind every time I go to bat. Yes. You are a very young player and you have two 50s against Namibia and one against PNG and you have played well. And I just look at it, him and you have better average. You, your average is 34 and your average is better than many. Aaron Finch, uh, Kane Williamson, Glenn Phillips, David Warner. You have better average than them. A lot of people don't know that, but you are such a good rising star to have. Yep. What do you think about that? Um, I, I actually never knew that. Uh, but <laughs> something very interesting, you know, to be competing yeah. with uh, people at the high level, yeah. where yeah. I've not yet reached, but still, I'm I'm still competing with them. That means, you know, there's uh, uh, there's talent, you know, in Africa too. You know, sometimes uh, most people don't look at that. Uh, but but you know there is a lot of talent and a lot of hard work, and yeah, the hard work I've, I've put in it is it is actually worthy, you know, to be having that average and to be having those beautiful stats. That means I can st I can also play in that international level, you know. So it's it's uh, some something interesting, and I would like to maybe add on more achievements next year. Mm. Yes, uh, you. Another thing I've seen that you have the ten fifties, and it's as many as uh, like Mahila Jayawardene and Glenn Phil, They also have ten, and Shweb Malik has nine international fifties. So you are just competing with them. It's very good, good thing to have, and just keep yeah. up the good work, and you will go very far. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, uh, thank you very much. Apart from that, apart from that, I want to know about your personal passion, like in personal life. What do you like uh, apart from cricket when you come back home? What's your favorite pastime there? Um, me, I'm, I'm actually a sports person. I, I like sports a lot. If I'm not in cricket, I play tennis, I play hockey, I, I play basketball, badminton. So I'm basically a man of sports. But uh, out of sports, uh, yeah, I, in my casual time, I like watching movies. Yeah, I like, you know, having fun with my friends, you know, just, yeah, you know, to to be busy with my friends and my family. Sometimes I like uh, going to visit my mom, saying hello, being there, uh, you know, talking a lot to my mom. And yeah. Mostly spending time with my family. Yes, thanks. Oh, so next question I will ask that you do watch a lot of international cricket. So do you have any favorite team, favorite player, anything like that? Uh, 
Um, yeah, basically, you know, in cricket, every team is good. You know, actually, uh, d- depending on the, the recent World Cup, I really liked uh, Pakistan. They really played well. They had that uh, team game. They were, you know, uh, playing as a team. Everything was, you know, they really considered their team first. So I really liked Pakistan because of, of their style of play. And uh, yeah, my role model, um, I like Chris Gale. Some, uh, he's, he's a guy who, with uh, that magic technique. He hits a lot of runs. He has a lot of runs. You know, he has that powerful shots, the pull shots, uh, you know, deep extra cover drive. And yeah, that is a guy um, I sometimes look into his videos and, and, and learn a lot. Yes. I was just following your uh, Twitter and you call yourself as the boss. How did that happen? Yeah, you know, sometimes, uh, you know, uh, depending on uh, Chris Gale's, uh, you know, that name he calls himself, the star, he calls the, the boss. So I also had that, you know, I need to be the young boss. So I call myself the boss because, yeah, you know, I I do what uh, Chris Gale does, so um, I'm supposed to be called the boss. Also, you know, he's not he's not the only boss. I'm also here, the the upcoming boss who is actually coming in uh, to, to to take his place. Yes. So, what I understand is he is the universe boss, and you are the new boss. You are the junior boss, right? Yeah. Yes, I wish to see you in PPL in Bangladesh, in Pakistan, in Dubai, all the leagues around, and I want to see you there. Do you have any wish to play in any leagues? I have always wished to play in those top leagues. Uh, wish to play in those franchises: IPL, Big Bash. Uh, uh, I just hope I get a chance not to, to play the I think some technical difficulties. I'll wait for him. Hello? Yeah, can you hear yeah, me? Yeah, I'm, I'm getting you. I, I was saying, uh, I really I really want to have that opportunity to play in those top leagues. Uh, I would love to have that opportunity also to, you know, to show my talent and my capability to those uh, world-class teams, maybe to show them that, yeah, they started elsewhere. There's also some talent in Africa that is maybe coming in. Yeah, I, I hope I, I'll get that chance to maybe have uh, a feel of the franchise uh, to, big tournaments. Yeah. Yes. Your brother also plays. I look at uh, the profile. Your brother also plays. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. My big brother also oh. plays. With the same team. Yes. Okay. So, yeah, that was all I wanted to ask. And wish you a very successful uh, career ahead and plenty of runs, plenty of success. And I wish you become the world boss very soon. And everybody knows about you, how good you are, how great a batsman you are and so how such a humble person you are thank you thank you thank you so much and uh, uh, i'm really so happy to to be live on on your channel it's uh it's a pleasure for mm-hmm. me it's a it shows that yeah there's, there's some someone who's maybe seeing my my efforts and yeah i hope i get chance to you know to, to play in those international uh uh tournaments and, and, and leagues. Okay, we will talk soon 
and have a good new year ahead okay see you my friend see ya take care all right thank you see you happy new year see you okay okay so that was my guest and we will see you next time thank you this is hakimel and we'll talk soon bye bye